it up. So they uh, gave her that special privilege. Susan Green from Alice Texas. And here we go with Debbie Combs. And Rocket Robin moving into action. Some very attractive and very skillful young ladies. Rocket Robin. Working very hard in the training center. In her first bout on Starfine, she received the highest grade by the judges of any of the graduates of the training center. And that was against Susan Green, who was refereeing this bout. With an outstanding performance, and Susan Green complaining that Rockin' Robin just pulled Debbie Cohn's hair. The crowd is somewhat incensed. And so is Rockin' Robin a bit upset. Susan Green right there. It becomes good boo. Nice work on the arm. Pump handling that arm. And Rockin' Robin takes it right back from Debbie. It is interesting to watch the fast progression of these graduates of the UWF Training Center. We saw the star find with the Sterling Brothers and the Fowler Brothers and what a tremendous bout they uh, gave us and what tremendous skill they displayed. Rocket Robin has proved herself just equally as skillful and has made great strides in Wild West Wrestling. This is Rockin' Robin. Nice roll up on Rockin' by Debbie Combs. She rolls that headlock. Debbie rolling that headlock on Rockin' Robin. They get a close look, Susan Green. Rockin' Robin is not only a wrestler, she is an accomplished singer, an actress, with a great number of talented skills. Debbie Combs continues to hold that headlock. Very exotic young lady. Oh, Robin trying to find some way to... Oh, now there was a hair pull by Debbie Combs. And Susan Green didn't see that. And now she's calling a hair pull on Rockin' Robin, which... Uh, well, I've, I would have to take a look at that because I saw Debbie Coombs use the hair, but I didn't see Rockin' Robin. And I'm not sure uh, that Susan Green is getting uh, very much uh, support from the crowd of, of Billy Bob's Texas. Speaking of Billy Bob's Texas, we'd like to invite you to join us at Wild West Wrestling anytime we're on hand. Billy Bob's Texas is a wonderful, wonderful place not only to watch Wild West Wrestling, but to bring the entire family. There's so many games and so many fun things to do. And it is spick and span clean. It is a very, very delightful place to spend some time. To listen to music, to play the games, and to, wild, to watch Wild West Wrestling. A family place. And while you're sitting around ringside, the waitresses come up and take your order. Very, very uh, delightful atmosphere. Saves you having to lose some of the time at the bout. So join us in Billy Bob's section. A friendly family place on the north side of Fort Worth in the Stockyards District. Oh, Rock and Robin. The body scissors by Debbie Combs being pressured right now. Trying to figure a way out of this. And she is... Driven into that mat again. Here's that roll of the body scissors. That'll make you dizzy. And Debbie Cobb's doing quite a job with it. Like a merry-go-round. And they roll into the rope to see if they're going to break it. They do. And Debbie Combs will have to give up that body scissors. There's one of the waitresses we were just talking about. So Debbie Combs comes back, gets a leg lock, and then moves it into a reverse, bars the legs, and has Debbie Combs in charge of this right now as Rockin' Robin. Has lost some of the momentum to the young lady from Nashville, Tennessee. Helen 
back. Trying to make Rocking Robin submit. And she hangs on. Once again, she has. And the crowd picking up the chance for Rockin' Robin. Ah, nice kickoff by Rockin' Robin. See if she can take advantage of this now. Good head flip. She goes right back in there again. Here comes Robin. Yes, slipped off a bit. Now she makes a reverse flip. And Debbie Combs is in trouble. As Rockin' Robin turns the momentum back. She unleashes quite an attack here. Robin with a catapult. And out goes Debbie. Ooh. Stepped right into that shoe of Debbie Combs. And Rockin' Robin is flattened. And well, this bout has seesawed back and forth. Combs. Running through Rock and Robin. Out goes Debbie onto the floor in that collision. Dropping Rock and Robin. Susan Green, the referee, taking over the bout. Now Debbie Combs, I don't think, realized what happened. Now it's a count of one. And she's now come around and said, wait a minute, what's this? And the discussion, the argument is on now as Susan Green is perturbed. She get here is Nicola. A good, good close friend of Rocket Robin. And she's pointed out to Debbie Combs that Susan Green made an unauthorized move in helping Debbie try to beat Rocket Robin. 